What's up YouTube? So as requested, I'm gonna be doing a video where I just cover my whole workout. It's just gonna be the workout in the video um, itself. So no fancy music, no like, I mean, I'll do a little bit of editing, but what I'm gonna do is go over all my exercises, sets, reps, like everything you guys will see exactly how I train. Um, so what I'm gonna be doing tonight is like, I'm gonna do like a push day, which is different. I'm thinking of, I'm gonna be starting a lean bulk soon. I think when I'm gonna start my lean bulk, I'm gonna transition from like my bro split to a push-pull leg. So push workout tonight, um, that's not set in stone, but that's probably the plan right now. Um, so chest, shoulders, and arms should be a good workout. I think Becca, is that Becca outside? I think that's her, yeah, she's like lost. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we're gonna get to the gym, record it, show you guys what I do, and uh, should be a good workout. All right guys, so we're at the gym, doing a push workout. Push is, for those of you guys that don't know, chest, shoulders, triceps. I'm doing incline, Becca's doing flat. Uh, so I like to start my push days or my chest days with an incline movement because that's going to hit more of the upper chest. So I've already warmed up with the bar once. I want to stress the importance of warming up. I usually like to warm up with the bar, whether it's for squats, bench press, shoulder press, at least one or two times, like 10 to 12 reps, just get the blood flowing. It's going to help prevent injury. I know a ton of guys like to throw weight on the bar without even warming up. Bad idea. You just want better, safe, and sorry. So we're going to put a plate on. Um, I'm going to show you probably one or two sets of everything I do. I'll just kind of walk you guys through what I do for working out. Alright guys, so I'm going to do warmed up with the bar, one with a plate. Sometimes I'll go put a 25 on and do like an extra warm up with that, but I'm just going to jump to two. So far my shoulders feel good. Um, like I said, I'm kind of actually getting in back to the swing of things. I got sick a few weeks ago. I was out for five days. Now I'm uh, trying to kick my butt in here and hopefully probably sometime in March start a lean bowl. So it's kind of funny, I'm going to start a lean bulk when summer comes, or when spring comes, but probably going to shoot for six to eight, we'll see how this goes. Bad. All right, so I'm gonna try to get five or six. Um, I used to be able to do 275 for like, what was I doing? Like three to five? I think I was getting like fives, but um, I should be hitting 275 for a good working set soon. So this is 245. I'm gonna try to go like four to five reps here. So I did three sets of, I just went up to 245, then I did another set of 225. Now I just got one plate on here. So what I like to do sometimes at the end of my set, 
or I'm sorry, not the end of my set, but at the end of the exercise, I like to just drop the weight and go for more reps. So I'm gonna do like a rep out is what I call it. Um, I'm not gonna go to failure because I don't want to go to failure at the beginning of the workout. I'm just gonna go for like 10 to 12, get a nice wide grip, and really kind of burn out the chest a little bit. So. Nice and wide. Um, you guys see where those lines are? I'm gonna go probably just pinky finger right out that line. So I don't like to go to, like, it would be not a good idea to go to failure right now. This is the first exercise of the workout, so going to failure is like a tool, but you don't want to do it, like, all the time. Second movement we're doing is going to be a dumbbell shoulder press, so I'm not used to doing, like, push-pull legs. I think, like I said, that's what I'm going to transition to when I start bulking up, like a lean bulk. But, uh, shoulder press, so... Generally, when you're doing like a push-pull legs routine, you want to do, if you're doing a push day, you want to start with some sort of chest movement because your chest is bigger than your shoulder. So you want to start with the chest movement, and then you want to do a shoulder movement. So we're doing the dumbbell bench press. I'm going to warm up with the 45s, and then we're going to get into some working sets. I'm at 80, so I just want to see how they feel. This will be my first working set. Not a good sign, guys. Mr. Doughty, I'm Mr. Doughty. Is it on? It's going? Yes. You can go over here. Actually, nobody's back there. It's good? Ah. Uh. Okay. Alright, guys, so third movement we're doing is a fly, so we're doing a chest fly today. Um, a few things on this. I don't like to go like super heavy. I mean, there's times in. There's a time and place for that, but I'm just gonna warm up with 100. I'll go probably go up to like 150 or so. Big thing with the fly. So you got a machine fly, you have a dumbbell fly, you have like a, like a cable fly. Yep, so I mean those are pretty much your types of fly. Any type of fly you do, it's all about getting the stretch. So you want to stretch out that muscle and the contraction. Stretch, squeeze, stretch, squeeze. A lot of people go way too heavy on a weight like this when the whole motion, like if you're doing like this and you can you can't even like get a good contraction or you're if you see somebody that's really struggling on this they gotta lower the weight so do a weight that you can really like feel by the time you're doing done doing your set your chest should be on fire you want to feel that burden so we're gonna get into it let's try to do 12 reps or so good squeeze in the middle stretch You guys can kind of see how I pause it for a split second. Squeeze, pause, and I'll get a stretch. It's already warmed up. Um, last thing we're going to be doing is I'm going to do a super set. I'm going to do some rope push downs for the triceps. Again, nothing too heavy. I'll probably go up to maybe 100 or so. 
Again, guys, everything 12 to 15 reps here, three to four sets. And then I'm going to be doing some laterals with the 20s. So 12 to 15. Gotta get that squeeze on the bottom, good stretch. Keep your tension on your triceps. Muscle, so you don't need to go so heavy. See a lot of guys go way too heavy. Form goes to shit. What's up guys? So back from the gym. Workout was great. Like I said, push workout. So I'm thinking what I'm going to be doing is when I transition into a lean bulk, I'm going to be doing um, maybe push pull legs. So for these videos, I think as of now, I want to just keep it um, just for the, at least for the strict workout videos, like strictly workout. Like I don't want to show you guys anything else. Some people are here just for the workout. Let me know, please, please, please comment below. Do you guys, for these workout only videos, do you want me just Strictly workout footage like you know do the sets and then I'll describe what I do Do you guys like this kind of video? Let me know Let me know if there's something you want me to tweak like I said I do these videos for you guys. I want to make them informative educational But push day we just started with um, obviously a chest movement. I did the incline bench press So pretty much everything I'm doing four to five sets for everything um, today was mostly four sets I believe and then anywhere between I'd say um, as long as it's not a compound movement, um, 8 to like 15 reps. So bench press, I was hitting around 6 to 8. Again, that's a compound movement. So compound movements like a bench press, your shoulder press, your squats. Um, in this case today, bench and shoulder press. I was striving for I think 6 to 8 at least, if not um, 8 to 10. So let's say compound movements, we're doing like 6 to 10 reps for the bench, shoulder press, everything else, more isolation. Um, anywhere from 8 to 15. So we start off with the bench press. Incline barbell bench press. Second thing was um, dumbbell shoulder press. Third movement was chest fly on the machine. And then the fourth, fifth movement was a bit of a superset. I supersetted rope tricep push down with um, dumbbell lateral raises. So five movements total today, guys, for the push workout. Really good workout. I enjoyed it. That's what I'm thinking about transitioning into. Um, comment below your guys' thoughts. Let me go. Uh, let me know if you liked the video. Give it a thumbs up. Other than that, I think I'm going to do maybe one or two of these videos a week. We'll see how they go. Um, I appreciate you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Macro, macro, like a vision board, I see with clarity. I hustle like my name was Gary V. For more than the wealth of prosperity. Accountants was talking about equity. I'm Triple H.